नमस्कार सदगुरु जी दिस इज आयुष्मान खुराना एंड आई एम अ वेरी पोलिटिकली अवेयर पर्सन एंड पोलिटिकली इंडिया इज इन अ वेरी वॉनरेबल स्पेस बिकॉज इट्स अ प्लूरलिस्टिक सोसाइटी वी हैव सो मेनी कल्चर्स रिलीजन रीजन कास्ट कलर क्रीड एंड आई फर्मली बिलीव दैट बोथ एक्सट्रीम राइट विंग एंड लेफ्ट विंग आर एक्सट्रीमली डेंजरस एंड माई पोलिटिकल स्टैंडिंग इज प्रॉब्ली इन द सेंटर सो वट यू थिंक इज द करेक्ट स्टैंड आयुष्मान one who lives long a living democracy means you never take a stance of any kind if you want a living democracy this happened in a very strong way in united states this became like two different religions in united states are you democrat or you republican no my grandfather was a republican my father was a republican so i am also republican it's all decided beforehand so in a living democracy you should never take a stance this is something we have forgotten our country is also moving in that direction do you belong here or there well i have not made up my mind for the next election let me see who performs how who makes more sense am i right left center no the moment you take this stance you are destroying democracy because you are taking it back to feudalism we are this tribe means we will only vote this way that tribe means we'll only vote that way you finished off the democracy there is no democracy left right now in united states I think the deciding factor is only about 4 to 5% of the people decide who wins who loses rest of the people are all fixed already In India the percentage probably is in the range of 10 to 12% maybe maximum 15% but I think post this coming election we will also get to percentages like United States because it is getting so vitiated that you have to belong here or there you cannot say you don't belong anywhere i don't care who you elected the important thing is change of power happens without bloodshed that's the big thing about democracy slowly as you become tribal mindset i belong to this tribe or that tribe you are again taking it back to your place where there will be tribal warfare every time we want to change power this is what will happen so aishman you should not take any stance at the end of four and a half years take four to six months to evaluate what has happened whatever has happened in this four and a half years is it worthwhile to give them one more chance or is it better to get a new set of people is something that every citizen must take a call in the last three to six months so it is time that we mature as a democracy there is no need to take any stance